hierarchical inheritance in case of in hierarchical inheritance first of all i'm taking this class student now this class will inherited by two other classes like one class is study study is inheriting student class and using its public uh, sorry protected member like get student as well as show student and one more class is sports A sport class will also inherit student class because one student can be in study as well as in sports. So this is the main class, or we can say master class student. It contain its name and roll number method to feed these values and one second method to display all these records. Now this class will inherited by study class. so as soon as we will fill detail of marks first of all we will fill student detail his name as well as roll number and display like in the same manner in case of sports when we will fill student team as well as rank first of all we need to fill student detail so for that we will call get student in the same way we will call show student so we are inheriting one student class in two classes study so, uh, study as well as sports this is the concept of hierarchical inheritance when one class inherited by multiple classes now we will test this program class test here we will make object first study class because we need to study class we need to execute study class and uh, student class will execute automatically because it is inherited by study class so we will make object of study class study obj equals to or we can say stud equals to new study class and stud dot get study as well as stud dot get show study when we will these execute i'm saving this class as test test dot java we will save this program in bin folder of jdk c drive jdk bin and this folder i'm saving this test dot java java ek test dot java java test so it's asking enter name and roll number how is this possible as soon as we call get study we will come in this method get study and it's calling get student so we will come in get student method and first of all we will feed name as well as roll number of student now we will come back and now we are calling show study so in show study method before executing show study statement first of all it will go to the show student and will execute name and roll number of student after that will come in show study back and display physics chemistry math math marks and after that will close this program so we feed name amit roll number 101 marks of three subject are these this is the display of study class now we inherit student class in one more class that is sports so we need to create one more object of sports class to execute that for that we will first of all create object of sports class sports spt equals to new sports spt is the object of sports class 
we will call get sport as well as dot show sport we'll save this file again and after that again compile java test dot java java test now first of all this method is executing get study so we'll fill detail of student for study amit roll number and marks now this is the display of study now it's asking for sports class enter name sagar roll number 103 and ma uh, team name x y z and rank this so this is the detail of sagar for sports his name his roll number his uh, team name or his rank so like this we can inherit one class in multiple classes and this is the concept of hierarchical inheritance means we are making hierarchy by inheriting single class in multiple classes and we'll use this single class method in all those classes like get student show student is a method of student class and when we are inheriting student class in study we will use its method get student to feed information of the student as well as show student to display the student detail before displaying the study information and the same way we will do in sports and this thing we can repeat in number of times in multiple classes so this is the concept of single inheritance sorry hierarchical inheritance one class and multiple child classes 